writing. I hate that shit. If you're anything like me, English was your weakest subject in school and you preferred physics and maths because, well, writing didn't really matter and your work could speak for itself. And so let's talk about how you'll handle writing and engineering and whether or not it will be a problem for you. And there are a few things that I want to talk about and which I think might even bring you some relief. So let's begin. Firstly, in I believe all engineering degrees, writing and writing ability aren't assessed. Engineering professors don't care 1% if you don't know the difference between 2, 2 or 2, and I knew countless exchange students for whom English was their second language and frankly, they were shizer at it, but it didn't matter, and they did as well as everyone else. You know, when you're in school, your grammar and spelling are important, but not in engineering, so don't expect to get a grade taken off because you misspelled asynchronous or misplaced a comma. No one cares, because when you're getting massively complex, esoteric, and difficult to remember words rams down your throat every semester, everyone is spelling them wrong, using them wrong, and forgetting what they mean or when to use them, so everyone's grammar and writing is shit, and you'll fit right in. Next, you will rarely write text-heavy reports. Typically, your assignments and exams will be mostly numerical, and at the most you'll be required to write one sentence explaining something, and it's great. However, there are a few exceptions to this, like if you do your honours thesis, you'll have to write in excess of 15,000 words, or you might get the occasional report for engineering management or something, but I promise you this. When you get given an assignment that requires you to write a few thousand words, regardless of how much you hate writing, regardless of how bad you are at it, you will be joyous beyond belief because after a year or two in engineering, writing a few thousand words will be the easiest, least stressful and pleasant thing you will have to do. I remember working on my honours thesis and just sitting down, listening to music and autopiloting the entire thing. And writing is by far one of the least stressful things you'll have to do, so I promise you that you'll reach a point where you might even look forward to it. Also guys, don't forget that your professors used to be students like you and probably also hate writing and even if they don't, I guarantee they hate marking papers, and giving students several thousand word assignments means a lot of marking which they don't want to do so they rarely give them out, thank god. And finally guys, your writing ability isn't a static thing, and while you're studying you're going to be reading a lot, talking a lot, watching lectures a lot, and whether you like it or not, you'll become better at it similar to this plot. So if you suck at writing and if you don't feel confident with it, don't worry because you will absolutely make it through your degree and it really won't be a roadblock for you. And shout out to ProSal91 for requesting this video, I hope it helps you out. And here is today's chess move if anyone wants to play and also guys, thanks for being so great and I hope you're all well and thanks for everything. Also check out my new outro, it's amazing. I can't wait forever Old habits are hard